hello guys i am junaid back to you again today i am going to share a simple hack with our fdm dual tool hand so that you can avoid the jamming issue please watch the video till the end to solve the issue forever watch carefully otherwise the whole operation may fail first we will dismantle this tool head as you can see this is a fdm dual tool head so we will dismantle this tool head by opening these two screws so let's open this two screw okay we already opened this two screw and then we will open the tool head so before open the tool head you need to be careful that this slot may broke if you open it wrong way like this as you can see there is two slot one is this one and this one this slot hold by this one so when you assemble the tool head you can assemble it by this way like this so it's open right now now you will open this screw so that we can open this nozzle and hot end and then we will open this two screw okay so first open this one using this spanner you will also have this spanner in your toolkit box okay we almost open this and then then we will open this two screw So be careful that you don't lose this to washer. Okay, let's put it aside. All done. Now we will open this one and like this. As you can see, this is a white Teflon tube is come out. So let's put at side this two because right now we only need this one. Let's move on the next step. In this step, we will cut this Teflon tube into two pieces. We have a knife and now we will cut this Teflon tube into two pieces. So you need to cut the Teflon tube this side. So you see here is the joint. So we will cut this one here. Okay. We already cut into these two pieces and you need to make sure that you cut this one uniformly so that it can fit easily inside the hot end and inside the nozzle so let's move on to that next step as this two is our teflon tubes two part you can see this one and this one so right now we will put it that one aside and we will take this one and we will cut this filament tube at the same size of the teflon to use part so as you can see this is the same size and we will cut this one same size don't make mistake you need to make sure that you cut it at same size and make sure you cut it uniformly as you can see these two is same size right now so let's move on to that next step now as you can see we have three parts one is this one teflon tubes other part and this one is teflon tubes part and this one is our filament tubes part which is cut by the same size of the teflon tubes this long part okay so right now this part is our unnecessary part for this hack so we keep teflon tube this part and filament tubes this part let's see so what we will do right now we will insert this filament tubes part into this nozzle so you can see just push the nozzle as far as you can like this it haven't pushed yet so you can use a tool so that it can push inside it at the last level okay so now we will 
put this part into this end like this like this and we will assemble the tool head and fix the screws like this so here is a reminder that if your nozzle has some jam in that case this tube cannot go inside it so to avoid this one you can open this nozzle and clean it or you can uh, preheat the nozzle and then clean this one so then we will assemble the tool head as you guys know already let us know if this hack works and if it doesn't then we'll suggest you something else thank you so much for watching you can contact us through our facebook our email you can also join our facebook group for the real-time support have a nice day bye bye